I think we need to move the car. Yeah, we should. There's a lot of there's a lot of money right here, Damon. <laughs> All right, Kiki, I'm headed out. You hold down the fort for us here. Okay. Bye, Kiki. Let's try this again. Bye, Kiki. Hey man, you wanna go with me still? Here is the second bird's nest update, guys. We have this bird's nest above our front door right here. I finally caught the mama. Hey mama, I wanna vlog you. Yep, that's an all time high of my YouTube career. Good morning everyone, welcome back to another vlog. Jay, do you know what we're doing? Well, word on the street, folks, is that there's gonna be a Lamborghini somewhere in the vicinity. Let me go ahead. Cheapy Racing, I think is what it's called. These are the guys that built Alex Choi's turbo kit. So DDE, Damon from Daily Driven Exotics, his cars are apparently down here. And I randomly texted him last night, like, yo bro, we should meet up soon. He's like, I'll be in Temecula tomorrow. And I was like, I'll see you tomorrow. We're gonna go have some fun, hopefully with a Mercy Lago. Oh, we also brought Guaxilla out, guys. Guaxilla's legality. If you guys want me to make a video, kind of like a little update on that. I mean, we're, we're driving her. We're, we're driving her, and then there's a car over there. We're at a car. We're in car zone. We're, we're in a car zone, so. Ah. We found him, we found him. What do we What's got up, here, guys? We're doing all sorts of stuff, but this is my friend Kevin, and this is a Carrera GT. Amazing car by Porsche, V10. But he straight piped it. Oh my Probably god. The craziest sounding car on the planet. Oh no, guys. I'm ready. Fire it up, buddy. <laughs> oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, it actually hurts your ears. I said you're not ready. Yeah, I was not ready for that. Were you ready for that, bro? No. When you turned it on, I was like, okay, okay, I could take this. I could take yeah, this. And I was like, it's no, idling. no way. It's A idling. little surprise for you guys. So behind me here, last time you were at my house, you were just ordering this car. This is a 2007 uh, Lamborghini Murcielago. Oh. Specifically an LP640. So it was the last of the Murcielagos. And it's a man. No, it's got a stick <laughs> By the way, Alex Troy's car is here. No way. Yeah, it's all fixed. Oh, what the f a turbo issue and uh, wait and before it. before we move on to that yeah. that's that's the magic in this car I'll take Guys, it for this is gated manual there's only 27 of these in the USA yeah. absolutely insane and then Alex Choi's car some of you might know it had a turbo issue uh, but it's all yeah. it's all good now This is Alex Choi's car. I I'd say this is the Guaxilla competitor right here, man. I'm really proud of the kid. He pulled it off, and at the end of the day, you either love it or you, or hate, you it. hate it. Exactly, guys. Well, then, man, Everybody talks about it. Literally, this is Alex Choi's Huracan. It's getting its turbo replaced right now. She's running. She sounds beautiful. I gotta show you guys the turbos because they're they're painted. Look at that. what this car is. This was a Lamborghini Huracan, believe it or not. Now, what are some of the things, like overall, it has the full cage, exoskeleton, twin turbo. Right. I'm Alex from CB, oh. This is not really a production turbo kit. It's what we refer to like a stunt turbo kit for him. It's kind of fit his needs. So it's twin turbo, precision turbos, uh, 62 millimeter turbos. It's on Cybex downwind management. Uh, and then just wild everything, as you can tell, right? Christ. Super wild. Man. It's like, just look at it. It's right. like, it's so.
right now, guys. I would say that that is Guaxilla's competitor. That is the car that I think the only car on the internet to compare to Guaxilla. And I want to know if you guys want to race. You can see there's a Ferrari pulling out here behind me. A lot going on. Murcielago V12, 458 V8. Insane. If you guys want to see a race between me and Alex Troy, I need you guys to comment down below and smash the like button. The coolest part about this shop, it's 10 minutes from my house. It's like so close to me, so. This, this might be the new hangout spot, I don't know. So it's a little quieter in here now. It has like the full exoskeleton. It's got some of the body panels. It's got the lights up for like this. It's, it's just sick to like see someone that treats a Lamborghini like it's like any other car, you know? Yeah. He's not worried about reselling the car. It's not stop. And I can appreciate this guys because I had my entire engine bay painted green to match the actual car. And Alex got his turbos painted and all the pipes to match. V3, they have to meet. They have to meet. Oh, yeah, big time. So weird. Guaxilla's in the house versus the unicorn of Sheepy Racing. Who do you guys think would win in a race? This car or this car? Comment down below. And Alex, if you're watching this, we need to make that happen. I think everyone wants to see. Guaxilla versus the Unicorn V3. This would be a good match. This thing's about 800 horsepower to the wheel. My car is about 900, 950 to the wheel. I think it'd be a close race. Oh. The other side of Sheepy Racing right now. This is your Huracan, bro. You got two Lambos. Here, what's being done to this? Can you say, or is it a secret? Well, no, it's gonna get twin turbo, but it's in stages. So, supercharger had to come off, has to go back to stock, has to run right at stock. Levels. Okay. I had to put a new clutch in it just to make sure because I've been beating the hell out of it. Dude, I see it on the video. <laughs> the tire slayer. Tire slayer. They're putting a new twin clutch in it today, which is kind of cool. I've never seen this. And, oh, um, sheesh. Hey, this is this is the car you did donuts in my driveway with, right? It is. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. okay. Do donuts again when it's done. Let's so, go. New clutches because there's two of them. I don't know what I'm pointing at. Apparently, this is like a new basket. So this is the this is a Lamborg Lamborghini clutch. Yeah, twin clutches, new basket, billet basket. I don't know why this is better, but apparently it is. Because it's Lamborghini. Sure. Exactly. Boom. And then uh, they'll twin turbo it. But have you ever seen a turbo that big? Dude, I have not. Okay, guys, check this out. C6 Corvette Z06. Look at the size it's of this turbo. More turbo than engine. Literally, more. Do you know the size of this? No, it's just called big. It's For size comparison, there's yeah. my hand. And uh, that's the turbo, guys. This is a large cup, right? Like. It would it would it literally would suck the cup in, dude. Dude, there's like just like more Huracans in here, guys. We have the Viper up here, Camaro. We're on even Mercedes something up there. Evo, Evo built Evo. That Evo is crazy. We found the back end of Alex's car, guys. Look, he put his Lamborghini tail lights upside down. That's so epic, epic. Another Huracan. There's some turbos on a Huracan back Ooh, here. More turbos. And more turbos. This place is known for turbos. And the pretty stuff, titanium. Yes. And the Viper. I couldn't imagine driving a twin turbo Viper. I mean, it basically wants to kill you. Stop. Literally. Twin turbo V10. And this is, this is the Charlie. Hello, Charlie. Where, where are your turbos? There, everything else here has turbos. I got turbos on me. Oh, no way. <laughs> I was making a joke. He's got a turbo. <laughs> everything in this place has turbos. That's what I've come to conclusion. You got the twin turbos here. Holy. The kit, Holy. The pretty stuff is here on Charlie's desk. Gosh dang. So, yeah. Pretty oh. titanium stuff. Pick that Beautiful up. titanium. It weighs nothing. Oh. oh, my God. It's like a tin can. It's right. literally a tin can. You look really strong. That's ridiculous. You, you do look strong. This is like 10 minutes from my house. And I didn't even yeah. know about it. Turboed everything. Turboed everything. everything. How are the cars? Cars are coming along good. And this is my friend Kevin. This is Kevin. Uh, this is Kevin. Kevin has a, a CGT. And a couple other cool cars. Uh, yeah. A 74 couple. others. Just a couple. <laughs> um, so he's going to give us a ride in the Carrera GT today, guys. I this insist. is a big deal. I've never been in one of these. This is iconic. Straight piped. Straight piped. Let's get in. We'll do the start. Oh, yes. And then we'll bring it back to you. Wait for it. Dude, he's smiling. And I'm so excited. There you go, bro. Let's go, boys. Carrera GT. Let's get in. This is insane. We are inside of a Carrera GT. How much do these cost? A million dollars? Uh, How much about they cost? 800000 $800,000, dollars, guys. And we are mobbing.
God, it feels so refined. Silla's competitor, Alex Choi! What's good, brother? How you doing? It's all good, it's all good? Uh, your car's not here. Someone stole it. Where'd it go? Someone stole it. Call it's, 911? it's gone, you're gonna have to. Call the police. There it is. I found it, you don't need to call the police, it's all good. Now we have the driver. Choi's car does this insane, what's called closed loop. Uh, launch control. It's different than a factory launch control, and it does rolling anti-lag. Holy! Yeah, uh, I don't think rolling. So you can be rolling and build up boost down and build the boost, and then let it go, and it's like. Oh, I can hear you guys from a mile. Sometimes I embellish my reaction in cars because I drive so many. Cars. Yeah, of course, of course. Um, this was not embellished. That's like when I came back in the Carrera. Yeah. It was like yes, it, yes. it wasn't that. Yes. It, it was wasn't like, like for the video. Something different, yeah. new, and exciting, and you're like. I can't Whoa. wait till my car's gonna go. <laughs> Alright guys, Alex is first time driving the new Huracan. So Unicorn V3, and then this is my first time. Safety first. Pink seatbelts. So this you is a smile right now. <laughs> Dude, this is oh. Oh. the smile. Might be dead. What happened, bro? She's good? Is it faster than Guaxilla? I do. We should race. We're here to find out. This is a, a day of car ride alongs. Just about watch it. I can't believe that. That's cool. That pulled so hard, my arm muscles hurt from holding the cameras. <laughs> what is that? That's not real, bro. Twin turbo V10. Way to go. 11. 11. Stainless <laughs> I've been waiting for we have all three of the most famous YouTube cars all lined up here We have Damon's Mercy Lago. We got my GTR. We have Alex's Unicorn V3 Huracan that he just finished What a nice lineup. This would be the most iconic YouTube race Ever in the history in the history Hey, 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 you get have our shot. I would definitely lose <laughs> Hey, listen to this. We get a bunch of car YouTubers, we rent out an airstrip, and we have the biggest YouTube race of all time. Yes. Yeah, I have someone with a Porsche 918 that really wants to race myself. Yeah. Done. We should do that. We should make it happen. Join? Oh, yeah. Of course. No, how it depends how fast your car is. <laughs> if you want to see a massive YouTuber drag race with these three cars included, comment down below. It needs to happen. I feel like it needs to happen. Most iconic Huracan, most iconic GTR, most iconic Mercy Lago. What a good trio. Also, I have to ask, if you had one car that you could pick for the rest of your life, would it be the Mercy Lago, V12, gated manual, Guaxilla, or would it be the Unicorn V3? There's a lot of, there's a lot of money right here, Damon. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, he doesn't. You're an animal. Only Damon. Only Damon. Yeah, oh, damn. <laughs> Only Damon would do donuts in a Mercy Lago. Hey, Damon, you got rubber on my car, man. Eh. <laughs> Don't forget, you guys have the opportunity to win a trip 
to Hawaii with me for $20,000 cash. Don't miss out on this, guys. and like this beautiful video buy your merch at tfoxbrand.com hottest merch out there let's get it